Rakapalia, Rikapalia, Rekapolia. I press for somebody here. Every evil judgment upon your life. I stood upon the rock of ages. I drink the blood of Jesus. I speak with authority. Evil judgment place upon you. Let them catch fire. In Jesus' name, let them catch fire. 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 Evil judgment. That says you will not have peace. He says you will not eat the fruit of your labor. As the Lord liveth and the Spirit lives. Evil judgment. Jesus name let them be consumed by fire. 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 We shout this point of prayer. Evil hands that have a um, Prepare a cup for me. Every hand. A walk that prepared the money cost for me. It is what if I don't eat barade. I was here to confirm me. Let that cost by the owner. Jackie, what's it? Yeah, come by the sea. It is your shade. It shade. Go shade. Very well. My face is back. Come by dry. Come by the cuckoo. Uh, evil hearts that prepare evil a corpse for me to shut down my life and this year that person that prepare that corpse let it enter in by himself that person that prepare that corpse let it take my death prayer in Jesus name and if you have that prayer pray it if Hands. Prepare evil cups for me. Let it get me me for, for 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 my life to be shut down. Let it get me me guru to shut my life. And it took place a good one for her. That person that prepared that cups, let it enter that cups by himself. And it took place a good one for her. That person that prepared that cups, let it enter. And it took place a good one for her. That person, let it take my death. And In the name of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I want to pray so very well. I want. I'm not forgetting about God. Right, 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 right. I want to pray for the washman and his family. I'm not forgetting about God. Right, for a short night, delay. I'm not proud. I'm long working. Ah, you will shout this word of prayer at the top of your voice. Don't pray, Jabaki Jaba. Any judgment. Don't pray, Jabaki Jaba. Any government. Any kingdom. Ah, Jabaki Jaba. They gather themselves together. It is what God has done. To wage war against Washman and his family. Let it go good today, Lord. This year, show me at it. Delay. A lot of war. Ah, ah, Kekaina. Shout of war. Kekaogu. Shout of war. Kekaogu. Wage war against them. Oh yeah, today it just. Why <laughs>
Jesus Christ is coming soon for the world.
the bridegroom, the coming of the bridegroom. He will lead this corrupt world.
Oh 
your sanctification that you should abstain from things that defy but yourself be holy unto the Lord this is the will of God your sanctification This is the will of God, your sanctification, that you should abstain from things that defy, but yourself be holy unto the Oh Lord, we pray for more of you. That's why we are here. Lord, we pray for more of you. Oh, that's why we are here. Make us feed for the call unto holiness. Make us ready, give us grace to be holy. Oh Lord, we pray for more of you. That's why we are here. I pray that God's holiness will be reflected in our lives in Jesus' name. Shall we rise up on our feet? Shall we rise up on our feet? If you know that tonight you are going home with the biggest blessing, rise up on your feet. We want to receive from God this hour. This is the moment we have been waiting for. God wants to bless us with his words. Before the servant of God will come and give us the word of life, I want us to pray. You will pray and talk to God. Lord, reveal myself to me tonight. Lord, in the word of God, I will come out tonight. Lord, reveal myself to me. Lord, I want to understand your message for my life. And I don't want to come here in vain tonight. Do something great in my life tonight. Open your mouth and pray in the name of Jesus. Lord, I have come before you this hour. Lord, visit me in the name of Jesus. Reveal myself to me in a God's mirror tonight. Reveal yourself to me in your mirror tonight. Let me see myself. Lord, speak to my life tonight. I don't want to go home empty-handed. Visit me, O Lord. Visit me, O Lord. Open your mouth and pray. Open your mouth and pray. Pray and talk to God. Lord, visit me tonight. Lord, visit me tonight. Lord, visit me tonight. Lord, visit me tonight. Do something great in my life. Open your mouth and pray in the name of Jesus. Lord, visit me tonight. Visit me yourself. Speak to me tonight. Speak to me yourself. Lord, visit me. Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name we pray. 
In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Lord, accept our thanks. Lord, accept our praise. You are the one we exalt. You are the one we praise. You are the one we glorify. Lord, accept our thanks in the name of Jesus. Kings of kings, accept our thanks in the name of Jesus. Father, we praise you for who you are. We bless you for who you are. Thank you. Accept our praise in the name of Jesus. We are going into your word. Lord of the world. Speak your word to us. That which you have for us. That you have for our home. That you have for our family. That you have for our lives. That we benefit our lives. That we count us worthy to reign with you at the end. Father, speak it to us. The shelter of this, speak to us. At the end of everything, so that we may praise you and glorify your name. Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Let us be seated. I bless God, the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit that gives me the great grace to be one of his servants God that found me by his mercy glory be to the name of God in the highest likewise I bless the servant of God I thank God for the life of his servant he is Samson Jude, yes, Samson Jude. That God has been using this ministry that gives me this great grace to speak before the children of God. And I pray that that glorious kingdom that we are all pursuing in the name of Jesus we will not lose it in the name of Jesus. I also thank God in the lives of all the workers that allow me to stand before the children of God tonight. And I pray that our portion in the kingdom of heaven another person will not take it in Jesus' name. I thank God in life of everyone that are here this, this night. God that keeps us alive to be here. Glory be to the name of God. 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 While sitting down, I want us to sing this song before we go into the word of God. So let me The God that has power, your majesty, your sovereignty, the God that has power. That has my life. Your majesty. This is your majesty. The God that owns my life. This is your praise. Oh, 
Tonight, I want us. I want to tell us something. I want to speak on the topic that I say, I am the holy bride. I am the holy bride. I be or the holy bride. Iyawomima, the holy bride. Si abasho we pe eni ko ayamima tabi iyawomima. When we are talking about the holy bride, oje we pe eni ye oni eni kontishi akore. It means the bride has someone who is a bridegroom. Oni eni kontishi akore. She has someone who is the bridegroom. Any anyone that is capable of having a wife, a be any total lati jayawo, or someone that is capable of being a wife, a be any total lati nioko, or someone that is capable of having a husband, that is the person we call a wife. A only reality or tito. We cannot look at someone that is not mature enough. Abiti o si ni la no jo ti wo pe yes e wa yo ti to lati ni lati je iyawo. Someone that is not mature enough, we cannot look at the person. Iyawo and call the person wife. Iyawo a bride o je eni to je wi pe ohun gbogbo to ma so di iyawo o ti wa ni ikale. Is someone that everything that is going to make her a wife is already on ground. There is nothing left. Such a person is called a wife. There is nothing that is hindering her. There is nothing stopping or preventing that everything needed is already on ground. Let's open our Bible. I'm in the book of Revelation. Chapter 22. Verse 23. 17. 17. Eseketa jini ogun Ati emi Ati yawo Wipe Mabo Ati eni chokbo Kyo wipe Mabo Ati o unbe ingbe Ati eni ti o unbe ingbe Kyo wa Eni ke ni choba si fe Kyo ba o mi ye na lo fe And the spirit and the bride say Come and let him that hear it say, Come. And let him that is attached come. And whosoever will, let him take the water of life freely. A bride told a husband, Mabo, come. Come. There is nothing in me again. I am prepared. 
There is no hindrance on my way anymore. I am prepared and set for you. Come. A holy bride. It is only a holy bride that can say this. It is not a bride that is full of filthiness. It is not a bride that is full of sin. It is not a bride that is filled of deaths. It is not a bride that always go around committing fornication. If such a bride hears that the husband is coming, she will be terrified. She will be afraid. Why? Because of the steps she's taking. Because of the, her ways. She knows that if my husband finds me like this, there will be a problem. But a holy bride said, Come. When the bridegroom comes, when the bridegroom comes, all you hear is that is coming. Can you say come? Can you say come? A holy bride. Let's open our Bible. Revelation. 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 Chapter 21. Verse 2. Verse 2. Jerusalem Tutu. Ti Arun Shokale Lati Odo Olorunwa. Ti Amura Sile. Bi Iyawo. And I, John, saw the holy city, New Jerusalem, coming down from God out of heaven, prepared as a bride adorned for her husband. At it has been adored. Nothing is left behind. The only thing left is for the husband to come and then marry her. The only thing left is for her husband to marry her. Nothing is left. She has been adorned. What is that thing that is left in your life? That oh, see, yeah, for that does not qualify you for your husband to marry you. We are not talking about earthly husbands. I'm talking about Jesus Christ. What is it in your life? Where are you lacking behind? That disqualifies you from him to marry you. Let's open our Bible. Revelation chapter 2. Verse 7. Revelation chapter 2. Verse 7. 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 He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. To him that overcometh will I give to eat of the tree of life, which is in the midst of the paradise of God. It that overcometh. It means the bride that overcomes. The bride that overcomes. The bride that overcomes. The bride that's qualified. 
eat of the tree of life. Are you ready to eat of it? Has not the world sweep you away? Has not the world throw you away? Is what you are passing through, has it not turned to something else before your husband? What you are going to eat and drink, has it not turned you to something else? In are you qualified to eat of the tree of life? In are you qualified to eat of the tree of life? To drink of it. I pray. The grace to be a holy bride. God will give it to us in the name of Jesus. I want our Let's open our Bibles. Jeremiah to Jeremiah. Oriketa. Chapter 3. Verse 14. Jeremiah, Oriketa, Jeremiah chapter 3, verse 14. Pada saying, Pada, a ye akpe inda, Omo, Nyo luwa wi, Nitori, a meo be ini ya wo, a meo si mu yi, O kan inui lu kan, A ti meji, Ninui dile kan, A meo si mu yi wasi si o ni, Ton, O backsliding children, see at the Lord, for I am married unto you, and I will take you one of a city and two of a family, and I will bring you to Zion. God is calling us. Come. Turn. Turn from that behavior. From that habit. Leave it. I am ready to marry you. I am ready to accept you back. It doesn't matter where you come from. It doesn't matter the, 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 the town or the village you come from. It doesn't matter the family you come from. I am ready to receive you. To marry you. No matter how the no matter how your behavior may be no matter the sin you committed no matter the waywardness turn to me to me and I will marry you no matter the sin and the iniquity no matter all those disgusting things you have done you just turn to me I will marry you I will receive you back It does not matter what you have done in the past. It does not matter whatever you have done in the past. All the incidents of the past. This word is sent to you. Turn. He is ready to marry you. O Lord, in your pay. That song, uh, that singer says, "How pami la radao, how demi la de ogo." I'll be transformed and crowned with glory. How si be mi ni yawo? I'll be married off. Ni ne ogo, oh do baba. In the kingdom of glory, before the Father. I will be transformed. I 
will be crowned with glory. And I will be married in the kingdom of glory before the Father. So, boss, no matter the mighty clay you have entered, God is ready. Your husband, which is Christ, he is ready to marry you. The book of Isaiah 54, verse 5. Chapter 54, verse 5. Nitori ele da re ni oko re Oluwa awon omo gun ni oruko re ati olura pada re eni mimo Israeli Olorun agbaye ni a o ma pe for thy maker is thy husband the lord of hosts is his name and thy redeemer the holy one of Israel the god of the whole head shall he be called ele da re thy maker and it don't say that that made you and it don't tell us yet that created us into this world is thy husband Lotto truly only in your corner you may have every husband but we are talking about that great husband that will marry both man and woman and is thy maker I am Mimo, holy bride, the Christ, the holy bride of Christ. I am Mimo, the holy bride. I am Mimo, the holy bride. Mad be a letter, forget not thy creator. My Jack, you are why you are be a letter. Don't allow the things of this world to make you forget your creator. My Jack, you are what you are like. I just need to see for more back be a letter. Allow what you are passing through now to make you forget your creator. Naturally, back in it because of what? Oh, when you call it, he is the husband. Oh, when you go on your he is going to marry you. Go give any your sir. He doesn't just want any how person. Give any tag be one in one year. He doesn't want someone with filthiness. Naturally, pay any money because he is a holy one. Yes, he be any money and he's going to marry a holy person. In fact, he does more than earthly husband. And he is thy maker. I pray for someone. Every filthiness, every sin in your life. That will not allow your maker to marry you. Tonight, the Lord take it away from your life. I wish our amen will be powerful. The Lord take it away from your life. I'm in the book of Genesis. Chapter 3. Verse 16. Four Birina Nio Wupe, a mere soy Pandura at his lawyer at the Pupa Ni Panduni, while my bima Lada or Corre Ni Ifere, your smart fassy, or your smart shay, or reader. Until the woman is said, 
I will greatly multiply thy sorrow and thy conception. In sorrow thou shalt bring forth children, and thy desire shall be to thy husband, and he shall rule over thee. I said, okay, and I fell out. Lord of all glory, ni fere yo ma fasi, o mu yo smashe, o lori re. The last portion I want to use is, and thy desire shall be to thy husband, and he shall rule over thee. It means your desire will be to your maker. Lord, when it all said that, to who created you? Lord, when it all be on you, to whom is going to marry you? Lord, when it all my body came, to whom that is going to rescue you at the end? Ni fere you, thy desire shall be. Tios masolori, and he will rule over you. Iyeni we pa. That means all that supposed to occupy the, the heart of a holy bride, it should be the desire and the law and his action and behavior must be for a husband, which is Christ. The love of Christ must be in our heart all the time. We know how we put the love of our husband in our hearts. If he has not come, no food. If he has not come, no sleep. Even if there's a quarrel before, if he has not come at that time in that ah. night, there will be a problem. That is for every husband. How much more? The love of thy maker, who is your husband? Who is your head? That is in your heart. Lord of all. Thy desire shall be to your husband. That means the, the person you are having desire or you are desiring is the person you call your husband. In this world, is, is your desire to the things of this world? Is it this world that you are desiring that you call your husband? Is it money that you call your husband? Lord, and it's very fast. I pray if the love of Christ will not live our lives in the name of Jesus. Thou singer sings. I have Jesus a friend. He's more than everything to me. He's the one that my heart desires. He's a lily the bright morning star. Oh, 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 is him the a beauty person that is in your heart? In your and you very fast. Is your desire belong to him? In your in your Money, noon and night is 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 it the one occupying your heart? Second, say we bow on deep off. Are you not just pre pretending? Second, say we bow on deep off. Are you not just pretending? In the Lord, so you very and bend you up on it. Is, is love truly in your heart? 
Let's read another portion of the Bible. I'm in the book of Hosea. Chapter 2. Verse 19. Verse 19. Hosea. Chapter 2. Verse 19. O Sini Jesu Lore. O John Bogo for me. O Lara, what's your come if you need to know if I do. chapter 2 verse 19 and i will betroth thee unto me forever yea I will betroth thee unto me in righteousness and in judgment and in loving kindness and in mercies. He says, I will betroth thee unto me forever. Everything that is going to spend Christ. Let it fail me at your for him to betroth you and I. He has already paid for it. Gloria. That singer said, Mo farami fwa, Mo kuni tori le, Ki woba le ma, Yeah. 
marry you and I. Ah no! He was beaten. Call a gun now, Johnny Yawo. So that he can be through you and I. Ah, Johnny Yawo. He was crown a crown of thorns. Call a gun, Johnny Yawo. So that he can marry us. Ah, come on, Johnny Yawo. He was nailed to the cross. Call a gun, Johnny Yawo. So that he can marry us. Ah, go lock on leg. He was speared at sight. All that I need to spend over a wife, he has paid it. A mere fell for a me, did he lie? Nito, a mere fell for a me, Nio, go, go. I will betroth thee unto myself forever. Truly, I will betroth thee unto myself in righteousness. Need judgment, loving kindness, and in mercies. He has loved us before we love him. He has paid your bread price. There is nothing left again. He is only waiting for you. For your life to be holy. And so that he can marry you. And you will be with him. And you will, you will reign with him. And you will hit with him. The supper of the lamb. Father, please count me what this is. Le baba loke baba wakami ye keme le ba oje marriage supper of the lamb father please count me worthy I say odo akuto the marriage supper of the lamb le baba loke Father's kingdom. Baba waka me ye. Father, please count me worthy. So that I can dine with you. I want ye be queen wa ye wa. Those that are filled with filthiness. Oh, the super no rani be. They will not be with him there. I want ye be share me ma. Those that are not holy. Oh, the work be no rani be. They will not be with him there. I want to talk about few things that must not be found in the life of a holy bride. I want to mention so, uh, 16 things that must not be found that must not be found in the life of a holy bride. Oh, wow, Coco. The first thing. I am Mima. A holy bride. Who bought a genetic ship and shagger must not be committing fornication. I am Mima. A holy bride. I am Mima. A holy bride. I am Mima. A holy bride. Who bought a genetic ship and shagger must not be a fornicator. Great in your core. Jesus is the husband. Ma don't love the world. You have someone. Leave the world aside. Christ. Christ. Is your husband. That is going to marry you. The second thing. I am a holy bride. Must not be somebody that is committing adultery. Agbere. Adultery. 
Iwanibi. You are here. Iwalau. You are also there. Nibi gogo. Everywhere you are there. Iwanani. You are always there. Oh, I saw we And the Bible says. E mini money. Oh, saw we be. And you said. E mini money. Arame. I host my body. Baba say we mini mama say. I can use my body anytime. It's not thing that the we be. Have you forgotten? And you got it. Saw we be arame. Someone has paid the bride price. Someone has paid the price. What is so dear? Has paid the price. It's all of it because he wants to marry. Oh, get up. About to read. I am a holy bride. Who bought Must not be a filthy person. You are your tomorrow. Behavior, this habit is not good. Husband should not see this in my life at all. He must not see it. Run away from it. Don't allow filthiness in your life. Filthiness can destroy the relationship between you and your husband. I am a holy bride. Must not be an idolater. Number four. Must not be an idolater. Fury is a slave. Abandon idol worshiping. It is your idol is not your husband. You have your own husband. It is a Christian. Which is Christ. That will marry you. Fury is a slave. Abandon idol worshiping. Get out of it. Forsake it. If not that, it's going to hinder you to your husband. Number five. I am a holy bride. Must not be somebody that is fighting everywhere. Everywhere. Oti daru. They scatter everywhere. Awo miro atu masor. So people will be talking. Wani ah. We say ha. Christi timo bayi. The Christ I have accepted. Oba nonsense o. Does not take nonsense. To ba wa. Magbe fube. If if you do this to me, I will do that to you back. Nigba to ba wa wo ya idalo. When you begin to fight, see your core. And your husband comes that time. After you have scattered the ground, and you said, Ha, there's nothing you are going to say here. What if your husband comes that time? Will he marry you? Mugbadura. I pray. The grace to be holy. The Lord will give it to you in Jesus' name. The Lord will give it to us in the name of Jesus. Number six. A holy bride must not be a confessious person. A confessious person. Your husband does not need that. Does not want that. But you are as it is in your life. Um, Kalara, it is your husband is not happy about it. Oh, your belly to says, and his wound is getting fresh. And when he looks at so his, his wife, and he found that kind of behavior, there, ah! he will remember. See anything more song before he see the person I paid all things for. Seven, seven things. I am a holy bride. Must not be a proud person. I'm so proud that there's nothing anybody can do. Your 
Your heart does not like it. Your heart does not like it. Abandon it. Eight things. Must not be an angry person. Onye binweni yo. Angry person. Ohu kekere. Any little thing. Oti dagubule. You're hungry. Oti binure kaja. You are over hungry. O binude bi webe kaja. Come on, mo kujwe yoju. You are so angry that even to smash something on your children is nothing to you. To kill your fellow human beings is nothing to you. You chori peke ne. Because of what? You are hungry. Your husband does not want this. What is song bobo? He has paid all the What is song bobo? He has paid the price. What is song bobo? He has paid the price. There is nothing left. I am a holy bride. Must not be only Lara a confessious person. I am a holy bride. Must not be a gossiper. I am a holy bride. Must not be a drunkard. Eleventh. I am a holy bride. Must not be a murderer. Not until you take a knife or you carry gun or a cutlass before you kill somebody. Some people can kill another person with the word of my, their mouth. This kind of habit should not be found in the life of a holy bride. I am a holy bride. Must not be son that is confessious. Son that is confessious. I am a holy bride. Must not be somebody that is not satisfied with what he has or she has. I am a holy bride. Must not be a proud person. Oh, okay, that's. And the last one, I am a holy bride. Must not be a gossiper. Someone who backbites. That there's nothing he cannot say. He can backbite another fellow that the other person will just kill himself. I pray for you. Every habit that you have mentioned that, that may be found in anyone's life. I know Christ. The mercy of God. We take it away from our lives in the name of Jesus. We take it away from our lives in the name of Jesus. I want to tell you what we need to become a holy bride. What we need to become holy bride. Oh, what? The first thing. We must confess our sins. And forsake it completely. We must confess our sin. That means if there is sin in our lives, we are not. Holy bride. The husband is not happy to such person. Your husband is not happy at all. You may be thinking your own heart. I love it. I, my, my husband was wounded. I want to become a holy bride. Confess your sins. The second thing. I don't let it do anything We must be an obedient person. See, I shall learn to the commandment of God. I don't let it do anything We must be obedient. See, I shall learn to the commandment of God. Oh, what you are called, What your husband wants. Oh, when you go shift, that is what you must do. As a human being, 
We know what our husband wants. Our we women. We know that if we do this, only verse that if love is very. But if I do this, ah, my marry that ke jojure. He will be so angry with me. You don't even plan for it that ke jojure because we don't want to see the other side. Hey, it's even funny that he does not like. Ah, only for work we will not do it. Hey, it's not funny that which he like. That is what we'll be doing. And in that ikbono, we need to. Be obedient to the command of God. Oh, Keta, Bateri. And in that Magba Adura, we must be prayerful. Nigba Bobo, all the time. And in that Magba Adura, we must be prayerful. Nigba Bobo, all the time. Nigori Bekine, why? Satan, because Satan on the there is washing you. Kofeki Akore. He does not want your husband. He doesn't want him to marry you. And because of this, we need to be prayerful so that we can overcome. So that we can overcome all the devices of Satan. I pray we shall overcome the devices in the name of Jesus. We shall overcome the devices in the name of Jesus. Number four. We must always read the word of God. Which is the Bible. Why? This is the word of a husband. We must always listen to it. Always read it. I love it. I want to hear his voice. I want my husband to talk to me. We know how it is. We know how it is. We know how it is. When our uh, um, husband and wife they are still in courtship, so by it, if anyone has not heard the voice of the other, you say, Ha, say, Moshen, have I offended you? What have I done? You did not call me, you did not send message. You just hear a beam on the phone, you carry it quickly, and look at it. Why is the network? Why? Because he wants to hear him. And Latin Mark, I We need to always read the Bible. Latin Mark, our roller, study the word of God. This one will tell us what our husband wants, what he doesn't want, what we must do to him. I pray for you. The grace to always do this. The Lord will give it to us in the name of Jesus. The Lord will give it to us in the name of Jesus. Number five. Number five. We must always appear in the presence of our husband to receive from him. We must always appear in his presence to receive from him. Joko Oluwa. Sit down and say, Lord, what do you have for me? Where is that area you want me to adjust? Am I even a holy bride? If you come today, or you come right now, can I go with you? I might qualify to be your wife. To receive from him. And any area of our life that is not correct. Our husband will be telling us, I am my wife. It is this area. Oh, this is something you. about it. This one, you need to do something you. about it. Do this. Take this one away. The Lord will help us in the name of Jesus. We must live a holy life. 
must live a holy life. We should not allow the things of this world to take heaven from us. We must not allow the things of this world to turn us to the disgust of this world. We must not allow the things of this world. What we want to eat, what we want to drink, what we want to wear. Maybe we want to be like our friends. We want to be trending. This must not take away heaven from us. We must always live holy. We must behave holy. We must act holy. Seventh thing. Which is the last. We must be thirsty for our husband. We must be desirous of him. We must be thirsty for him. The afternoon, the morning, at night, in the midnight. We must be desirous of him. I want to know more about him. I want to know more. We must be thirsty for him. I pray that the grace to do all this Lord will give it to us in the name of Jesus the Lord will give it to us in the name of Jesus attitude that must be in the life of holy bride lifestyle that must be in the life of the holy bride Akoko, first one. I am Mima, the holy bride. Oh, but the journey walk well, eh? Must be gentle. Can you? What did I say? Adam alone. You are not talking. Oh, but the journey walk well, eh? Must be gentle. You journey be a call, eh? Because your husband, only walk well, eh? Is a gentleman. Lord, ah, truly speaking. When it comes to judgment, he's hungry. But he's a gentleman. The second thing, the holy bride must be generous. Anything sorry. Someone that is generous. Anything wrong in lower that help another. Anything that lifts other up. In Christ. You knew you were Holiness. Anything wrong in lower? Someone that help others. I am Mima. A holy bride. Oh, but a jail on your fair. Must be someone that love. And it's not fair on any. That love others. Be a correct, fair on any. Just as the husband love others. Must love. Don't eat anyone. Love. Others. Even if he's doing wickedness against you. Let your love overcome their evil. The fourth thing. I am a holy bride. Must be full of joy all the time. Must be full of joy all the time. Are your brother my queen or it must be filled with joy? The fifth thing. I am a holy bride. Must have peace with all men. For the peace. Must not think evil to anyone. There is no way I cannot go. She can because go. she's at peace with all men. Some people will say, hey. 
Am I following peace with all men? And the person that I'm working with, do I know the kind of thoughts? Ah, I to so they will begin to speak on scriptural speech. And it's all yawa. Oh, you can't. Oh, you're gumbe. Say, if I'm not quick, this one may harm me. I am Mimo, the Holy Bride. Oh, Kefa. Oh, what a journey, Pamora. Most have endurance. Only Pamora. Most have endurance. Only Pamora. Most have endurance. Let it talk all along to please a husband. Let it tell all to please him. Let it woo to please him. Must have endurance. Along with Jesus, God will help us in the name of Jesus. Because God will help us in Jesus' name. How many of you have mentioned five more things? I'm funny. The benefits. I'm funny. Benefits. So what? You know, can you In being a holy bride. I'm funny. Benefits. Oh, what? The first benefits. You shall not be called forsaken anymore. We shall not be called what? So I shall not be called forsaken anymore. I shall not be called forsaken anymore. Why? Not because there's no one that will marry you. Or because no, no. Because you have someone already that will marry you. Number two. You will not be empty again. Why? You have someone that will marry you. If you show for you that empty place, and that husband will fill it up. Why? You are ready for him. You are a holy bride. You are ready for him. Maturity. You shall be given a new name. So I be our friend in your I will be given a new name. So I be our friend in your I will be given a new name. I will say, you know, our friend in your new name. A holy bride shall be given a new name. Not a sinful bride anymore. Not a dolorous bride. Not a dolorous bride. Not angry person is now a holy bride holy bride you shall be given a new name God will give you a new name in the name of Jesus you shall be given a new name in the name of Jesus God will be happy towards her God will be what God will be happy towards her God will have joy. Whatever she wants, whatever she has, in the kingdom, it shall be given unto her. Why? Because she's holy bride. The last one. She shall be married. She will be married. This is a great privilege. Benefits. For her. Let's be on our feet. Let's be on our feet. How Pame Larada. How Jimmy Ladeo go. How Sibe Yao. Nileo go. Lord of Baba. How Pame Larada. How the man I do go crown with glory. How she be me ni yawo. And be married in the kingdom of glory before the Father. We are going to pray these holy prayer points. As of all, Lord, we are going to take God. Only one round, me lawa. Lord, help me. Let it die, ya chuchu. To be a holy bride. Let it die, ya me ma. Be a holy bride. Only one round, me lawa. Lord, help. Me, my capacity cannot do it. 
cannot do it. I cannot do it. But all I have cannot do it. But what I need, Lord, help me. To be a holy bride. Pray us in the name of Jesus. Lord, help me. Open your mouth and pray that prayer. Talk to the Lord Jesus. Open your mouth and pray. Pray that prayer in the spirit. And as we are praying, let's come before the altar. Let's come before the altar as we are praying that prayer. Talk to the Lord. Lord, help me. Help me. Help me to be a holy bride. I want to be a holy bride. I Open your mouth and pray that prayer in the spirit. Somebody is not praying very well. Pray, 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 pray in the spirit. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Let me say just one thing, then we continue our prayer. The concept of bride is giving us the picture of the intimacy between God and man. The concept of it is that God wants us to have intimacy with him. Just the way a husband and wife have intimacy. Very close. Amen. Amen. Praise God. So it's talking about intimacy. And there are a lot of benefits of intimacy. When uh, somebody is your intimate friend. For example, your husband. There are a lot of benefits. But from both sides, the husband and the wife. Benefits. Companionship is there. Amen. Amen. Your husband is your gist partner. That's how it ought to be. Although some family are not like that. The family is like barracks. <laughs> Amen. Amen. That's not how God wants it to be. be your Lord, your so your husband or your wife is your gist partner. Oh, correct, the person you discuss yeah. with. The person oh, you oh, talk oh, with. That, that is how God wants it to be. be your Lord, your so when we have intimacy with God, that is when we can enjoy a lot of spiritual benefits. The devil knows what we will enjoy when we are intimate with God. This is the reason why he has set up a lot of things that can distract us or keep us busy so that we will not have time for God. Praise God. 
This is why these days we have many Christians that they don't have the power of God in their life. Some, their spiritual gift is no longer functioning. The grace of God in their life is dying because they are very busy. There is no intimacy with God. It is from that intimacy with God you are going to receive fresh bread. Release his bread into your life. You are renewed. You are strengthened. You receive power for spiritual capacity. And I pray for you today that beginning from this moment, whatever the devil is using to affect your intimate relationship with God, you will overcome it in the name of Jesus. And then it's not just to say amen. There must be determination. And there must be revolution. Do you hear what I say? Determination and what? Yes. There must be determination. That henceforth, I will be conscious that I am a bride. Do you hear what I say? And that's determination. Then I said revolution means that there must be a change of mindset. There must be a change of routine. You have to set up things that will keep you busy with God. There are some of you you know the right thing to do. Sometimes you try, but you cannot. Because you cannot do it with your strength. Amen. Raise up your right hand. I pray for you in the name of Jesus. Strength from above that is needed for intimacy with God. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Receive it in the mighty name of Jesus. Receive it in the name of Jesus. That thing the devil is using to put discouragement in your heart. Overcome it today. In the mighty name of Jesus. Whatever that is standing between you and the bridegroom. I decree in the name of Jesus receive victory over it. Receive victory over it. You see, the Bible says, though the righteous man fought seven times, he will rise again. He will rise. Yes, there is a place of rising. I pray as many who has fallen, who has backslidden, who has relaxed, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, rise up back in Jesus' name. Rise up back in the name of Jesus. I decree right now any grace that is crawling. I decree in the mighty name of Jesus. Rise again. 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 Rise in the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus, the voice of the Holy Spirit that you have lost, I decree right now that voice is restored. It's restored. It's restored. It's restored. That angel that is released to be working with you, that you have suspended. 
I decree by the authority of God. Mercy of God bring him back. Mercy of God bring him back. Mercy bring him back. Mercy bring him back. Mercy bring him back. In the mighty name of Jesus. Mercy bring him back. In the name of Jesus. Mercy bring him back. 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 In the name of Jesus. 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 Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. I pray for that person. There is a struggle in your life that has made your convenient time to be useless. I decree in the name of Jesus that struggle overcome it. It's like it's only five person that is here. Because I cannot hear your amen. Overcome that struggle. Overcome the struggle. Overcome the struggle. Overcome now. Bore bye. Overcome now. Bore nisi. Overcome now. Bore bye. Overcome now. Bore nisi. Overcome now. Bore bye. Overcome now. Bore nisi. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh God, Jesus. I decree. Paniashe. That oil that dropped on that head overflow now overflow Marshall. 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 overflow Overflow in the name of Jesus. Inspiration. 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 Divine leading. Divine leading. Open heaven. Clear vision. Directive dreams. Our light on the sun. Divine trance. Our Yes, it's coming to you. It's coming to you. It's coming now. It's coming now. It's coming now. It's coming now. Somebody wanted to harass a woman and someone went to whisper into his ear, into his ear. Her husband is a soldier. <laughs> Do you hear what I say? Check what you say. The man wanted to harass oh, the woman. I was about, shouting. You know, about, you know, there are some men, they don't have shame. <laughs> I was shouting. <laughs> and abused the woman. <laughs> Somebody went to whisper. Her husband is a soldier. The man began to beg. <laughs> He changed the scene and began to beg. Please don't be offended. 
now Listen. how much more if the lion of the judah is your husband why are you living your life in fear why you afraid amen amen god want to make some people very powerful tonight powerful that you yourself you are going to be afraid i decree right now i hope you believe let the lion of Judah. The presence of the lion of Judah. Be evident in your life in the name of Jesus. Whosoever that wants to trouble you. The lion of Judah in you will confront him. But you see, I must tell you, there is no magic about this. There must be consciousness that you are a bride. This is one of the secrets of walking and living in victory. The bag bag be eniti a je. If we forget who we are, amomu ti ko ye ki a beru, ama beru mo. We should not be afraid of. We we'll be afraid of things that we ought not to run away from. We will be running from them. And then, but today, I pray for you. The grace, the grace. Holy of fena. The grace Holy of it. to be so conscious that your husband is Jesus and that you are his bride. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Jesus. Somebody asks, What is it that whatever you declare come to pass? It is because I know I have a father who always listens when I speak. And he says, Whatever I say in his ear, he will do it. And he doesn't lie. Doesn't lie. A human being can tell lies. But God never would never tell a lie. I decree today in the name of Jesus. The consciousness that you are his bride. Receive that consciousness. Receive it now. 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 In the name of Jesus. I shared a vision with my wife. I saw that people were put in a something like a camp. The place was heavily secured. And I look, this is I must I must escape from this place. I saw a lot of faces I know. So I summon courage. And I begin to walk. I begin to walk. Then I walk from that very, is a very big building. As I walk out, 
I look behind me. I want you to listen what I'm saying. As I look behind me, I discover that those security in charge of that people of, of that place, they knew somebody have left. And so they came after me. And they were running. Then I got to a place. And I stood. And these people, they searched. They were passing my side. And they were shaking. They were searching. And I was looking like this. I was looking and they were searching for me. If it's more dross, more than back, 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 back. I was, they were passing beside me. What they want me? And they are searching for me. They were searching. And I was standing. I was just looking. Then something happened. One of them faced where I was stood. I was looking and looking. See, let me tell you something. The enemy has power. You must also have power. I'm telling you the truth. When Moses appeared before Pharaoh and his rod turned to serpent, Pharaoh laughed. Pharaoh that one is not new thing. He called out his own magician. Oh, come out! They throw down their rod and he turned to serpent. This word, power, come back with power. The higher power we overcome the lesser power. Do you hear what I say? And that's the reason why the, 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 the levels of God's presence to carry in your life determine your spiritual capacity. Amen. Amen. And as that one was looking, he called others and said, this is the person we have been looking for. Then I begin to sing a song. The Bible says, thou hast given me the song of deliverance. As I begin to sing that song, they left me and ran away. As you are going to sing and pray, they become weapons of deliverance. They become weapons of deliverance. They become weapons of deliverance. Wherever your life had been camp spiritually, making you to be weak physically, making you not to have zeal for the things of God, that is quenching your spiritual fire. But I swallow your heavenly vision. Today you will escape. I say you will escape. Yes, Allah. You will shout with a voice that carry fire. My father, my father. Oh, can you shout it loud and clear? Deliver me from every satanic trap. That my life has entered. Open your mouth and pray in the name of Jesus. Deliver me from every satanic trap. That my life has entered. Deliver me. Deliver me. Deliver me. Deliver me. Deliver me. Deliver me, 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 deliver me. Somebody pray in the spirit. Can you come back to me? Pray in the spirit. Pray in the spirit. Pray in the spirit. The Lord is listening. Pray. 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 Deliver me. Do me see Every satanic trap that has quenched my fire, that has swallowed my vision, deliver me, Lord. Rescue me. Rescue me. Rescue me. Rescue me. Rescue me. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Ben. God is doing something. If you can add more fire to that prayer, freedom is taking place right now. Freedom is taking place. 
Omnira Freedom. Freedom. Omnira Freedom. Omnira Freedom. Omnira Freedom. Omnira Freedom. Omnira Freedom. Omnira Freedom. Omnira. You must be free from that trap. Omnira said. That trap that is weakening your spiritual life. That is making you to be tired. That is making you to be weak. You must come out from that trap. Yes, thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. I pray for you. Any trap you have entered, escape by fire. Sola, no bano, no god, Jesus. Escape by fire. Dead any bano. Escape by fire. Dead any bano. Escape now. Dead the body. Escape now. Dead any sin. 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 Escape now. Dead. In the name of Jesus. Lord God, Jesus. I decree whatever the devil has done, his oh, agent has God done in order to suppress the call of God in your life. Let that in catch fire. In the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus. The Lord said I should tell somebody. He said, the more you disobey my instruction, he said, the more you rotate in one place. The only way forward is to obey the instruction he has given to you. So the more you disobey him, the more you just be rotating. No matter the effort, no matter how much you try, just be rotating until you obey his voice. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yes. Who want to be silent? I just told you, I just told you, I just the Lord said, that we should pray. So I want us to against vengeance. The cry of vengeance. The cry for vengeance. So I want us to sing that song for just five minutes. The cry for vengeance. So I want us to sing that song for just five minutes. Just five minutes. Just five minutes. Aha, yes, yes. Aha. 
to Missile. over my life over my family blood of Jesus silence them please pray very well amen Amen. praise God I want to know those that were in the boat with Jonah they were not guilty of anything they don't know anything. Jonah wants to implicate them. It's not that he was thrown to the ocean. Eh? The worst thing is that those people will die and God will preserve the life of Jonah. <laughs> when David went to number Israel, is it David that died? Badura. Pray. Blood that is crying for vengeance. Lori ayemi. Over my life. Lori delay me. Over my family. Sherry, I do go tell you on going to me. The the streets you live sometimes. I don't feel your sick. Where something you want, what you want, my sir. Put you. I'm telling you. In a position. In a position to partake. In a vengeance that you don't even know anything about. You don't know anything about. You are going to pray. Any blood that is crying for vengeance. Over my life and family. Lord of Jesus. Silence them. Open your mouth and pray. Pray, 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 pray. pray. Lord, God, Open your mouth and pray. pray. Every blood that is crying for vengeance, Lord, I hear me. Lord, I hear me. Over my blood of Jesus, silence them. 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 Yes. 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 Oh yeah, power and man, but what Don't come for a son, Lord, I give me a dead Power and man, in Jesus' name, we are praying. Lord, God, just like that. Amen. Amen. A Jake Badura, please pray. Taleni Kenita, Palekun, to get going, confident, delay me. Who is that person? 
that okay let me say it who is that person that was put in sorrow that was put in tears that now cause my family that now cause my lineage that is making me and cry to be five and six that is making our family and cry to be five and six God of justice and mercy silence them today Silence it. Silence it. God of mercy. God of mercy. God of mercy. God of mercy. Let him be silent. 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 That woman pray. That woman pray. Pray, pray, pray very well. Ah. In Jesus' name we pray. There is a brother here that is the source of your problem. There is a cry for vengeance. I pray for that person. Any cry that is calling for vengeance over your life, over your family. Because you are here today, I silence them. I silence them. I silence them. In the mighty name of Jesus. I silence them. Things you know nothing about. I won't go to my one message. That is now bringing up different problem, challenges in your family. Today, the blood of Jesus judged them. Jesus, In the mighty name of Jesus. Lord Yes. Ben. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. As we are praying that prayer, I saw a thick mark. It fell off from the body of somebody. Every mark of vengeance you are carrying about. The blood of Jesus has removed it. The blood of Jesus has removed it. Within five minutes. We want to do some prayer exercise. And I want you to believe what I'm saying. Amen. Amen. What did I say? Believe. Because if we believe, we will see the glory of God.
The fact is this. Prayer does not bring down money from heaven. It's only blessed the work of your hand. Amen. Amen. There is a place of dominion God wants us to operate. As his bride. As the prince and princess. And we want to exercise it. And I want you to believe it. Because it's going to work. Amen. Amen. So did the testimony of that our brother that somebody will always come and ask the wife whenever she is pregnant, are you pregnant? If she say yes, the next thing is discourage. And we, we, we pray together. And she became pregnant. I will pray some prophetic prayer. When I say prophetic prayer, I hope you understand what I mean by that. Okay, I'm not <laughs> Selema, no. <laughs> Praise God. That is standing in our dominion. Standing in our dominion. Declaration of faith. And then the pregnancy became invisible to those people. She be, you know, you hear what I say. Uh, I don't mind what is say. <laughs> Praise God. And then till when it was getting close up for her to put to bed, the husband had a dream that the wife gave birth prematurely. I told him I said no. God did not say that. That's the report of the enemy in order to water down your faith. So put that vision, that dream into the trash. Because what God has said you surely stand. I'm telling you, the baby is very healthy today. Doing well by the grace of God. Amen. 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 This is my point. You must walk in dominion. You must walk in what? Dominion. I am telling you, Satan hates anything that belongs to God. There was something that happened. They said there was something uh, that the, maybe the baby is too hygiene. Something, you know, those white people now. <laughs> And they said they are going to do so and so thing. And then they told me. I told them we have to believe God's report. And it is God's report that stands. Amen. Amen. So you want to walk in dominion. You want to make declaration. My life. Is not meant to struggle. Beginning from this moment, things become easy and simple for me. Do you believe that? Now, as you are praying that prayer, that's the reason why I say prayer exercise. You are going to be walking around. You say, as I walk in dominion, my life is not for struggle. My life becomes easy and simple. Success will not be difficult for me. Now begin to make declarations. As the Spirit of God is going to put it in your mouth, make that declaration. Make that declaration. Make the declaration. Make the declaration. Make the declaration. Yes. It's working. It's working. It's working. It's working. It's working. It's working. Confusion is not my portion. No. It's not my portion. I'm not meant to be confused. I receive direction for my life. I discover divine direction for my life. 
and I walk in that direction. What troubles others cannot trouble me? No. What trouble others cannot trouble me? What scared others cannot scare me? What stop others cannot stop me? What kill others cannot kill me? As I walk, I pull out and I pull off obstacles that had been stopping me all this while. I walk on you and I enter into my promised land. We are not joking. Something is happening as we are praying the prayer. This is very prophetic. Very, very prophetic. Yes. 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 Dominion. I walk in 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 dominion. I can do all things through Christ that strengthen me. I achieve what is difficult for me to achieve. Where I am experiencing failure. No more failure. I am not meant to fail. Because the word of God says I will be the head, not the tail. Pray, pray, pray. I shall not borrow to survive. I shall not borrow to survive. The Bible says I will lend to the nations. Therefore, I key into that promise. I key into that word. I begin to receive ideas that will command worlds. Inspiration from the Lord that will command worlds. That will make me to learn to the nations. Somebody pray. Pray. Lord, breathe into my creativity. Breathe into my creativity. Every dullness in my creativity, get out! I'm not meant to be dull. Because the Holy Spirit in me is not a dull spirit. It's an excellent spirit. It's a smart spirit. I shall be smart and intelligent in decision making. I will make intelligent, dis intelligent decisions that will lead to my promotion. That will cause a shift in my life, in my family. That my blessing and wealth will be a mystery even to the enemy. That even the enemy will be confused in the name of Jesus. Pray, pray. 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 Make that declaration. In Jesus' name we have prayed. The Spirit of God put it in my heart. The husband's responsibility is to provide for the wife. Who is your husband? Eh? Oh my God. Who is your husband? Who is your husband? So his duty is to do what? Is to provide. You are going to pray. Beginning from this morning, I shall receive daily provision from Jesus, my husband. Open your mouth and pray. Pray, 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 pray. Daily, 
daily sufficient provision. Hallelujah. Daily sufficient enough provision from Jesus, my husband. Yes. 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 It is for me. Yes. That was a Christian. Daily provision. Sufficient enough provision from Jesus, my husband. Mukba. 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 That was a law. Mukba. It was so much. That was a Jesu. Look at this. Mukba. I receive. I receive. I receive. I receive. Sufficient daily provision. I receive it from Jesus. I receive it. I receive it from Jesus, my husband. I receive it in the name of Jesus. Thank Thank you. You. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Wow. This is this is amazing. I just want you to walk in this faith. I'm telling you. Daily provision. Sufficient enough provision that surpasses knowledge, understanding. That shop that is boring, who longer? It will not be boring again. That business that is boring will not be boring again. Yes, because it's the duty of your husband. It's your duty of your husband. Ah, this shop is going down. I need ah. more goods in this shop. You know how you used to tell your husband. Ah. Ah. Daddy, what the heck is this shop you see? I'll be back. I decree in the name of Jesus. In a mysterious way. Concerning that business, provision that is needed to get enough things. Receive it in the name of Jesus. It is done and settled. Lord, we pray for this community. Let there be divine intervention. At the end of everything, let there be shout of hallelujah. Put an end to confusion. Put an end to misunderstanding. Let there be peace. Let there be peace. Perfect peace. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Blessed be the name of the Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Walk in dominion and go back to your seat. God bless you. Clap for Jesus. Amen. Amen. God bless you. I say God bless you. Say God bless me. Say it again. And the blessing you have received shall be permanent. I want you to believe all our declarations. Amen. Amen. When I pray for you, I'm praying for myself. God is using me for me. <laughs> Praise God. Hallelujah. I was telling my wife sometime, God will give some word and I will give to people and at the end I will discover. Ah, so later, God will, told, God will tell me and say, the message you give, you don't know that the message is even meant for you. <laughs> It's even meant for you. The prophecy is for you. Amen. God always works in a way that is so deep and great. Praise the Lord. I pray that the Lord will empower 
his servant for us in Jesus' name. The man of God, God have used for us more grace in Jesus' name, more anointing in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Uh, how many of us remember what we have this week? This week is a week of charity feast that we'll be having at Edu. So the program is uh, is a three program Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Amen. Amen. It's always a wonderful, powerful program. Praise the Lord. There's somebody here that you are scared because of a particular dream you used to have. You will not have that kind of dream again. The dream has stopped. It has stopped finally. And then uh, that signs of Osa, the person is that person is feeling. The Osa is totally gone. Completely gone in the name of Jesus. So, when we go, and that's the workers, when we go on Thursday, because being this holiday period, we will not be coming back until Saturday for the workers. But for those of us that want to come on Saturday, if you want to come on Saturday, can I see your hand? You want to come on Saturday. There's going to be a free bus that's going to pick us from this place. Can I see your hand if you want to come? Praise God. So please, when we share the grace, put down your uh, put down your name put down your name with uh, mommy and your phone number. And then you have to come very early. Amen. So you have to go uh, come to the campground very early because the boss will come here very early to pick people. So please drop your number so that we can be able to be communicating so that they can bring you to the venue uh, our branch at Edu. And the Lord will bless you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We are saying amen, say better amen. And then when we are coming next week, this, this is all the day Don't come alone. Come with your children. Come with your friends. Come with your family. It's going to be a very wonderful program. And your life will never remain the same. And as we are having this program this week, I want you to have, you know, desire, something you want from the Lord, something you want God to do for you. Yes. And there's going to be peace. I want you, don't live your life in fear. Do you hear what I say? It's going to be peace. There's going to be peace. God has taken over. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. So come, make sure you come with a desire. Believing and trusting God for what the Lord is going to do for you in that program. You always go to a program with expectation. It's very important. And the Lord will bless you in Jesus' name. Uh, let's rise up. We are done for today. I'm sorry I have taken 12 minutes of your time. And I want to beg us if your house is far, please stay till the break. Thank God there is no, there is no mosquito. Or is there a mosquito? Eh? Plenty. <laughs> I thought the heat have chased them away. <laughs> Praise God. So please, if your house is far, just relax. You can command those mosquitoes. See, I'm a child of God. I want to sleep. Don't trouble me. And they will not come. Or you don't believe that. Faith does not You have that level of faith. Praise God. If 
lion could not keep Daniel. Mosquito, mosquito cannot come close to you. Hallelujah. So please wait till daybreak before you go home. And the Lord is going to bless you in Jesus' name. When we share the grace, please walk us, come to the altar. We want to have a meeting. Let's rise up. Let's rise up. Amen. Amen. Please, I want you to ask one thing from the Lord. Very important. Just one. Very important. That one thing that is important, very important in all your requests. Just one. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. What God has done in our life shall be permanent. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. Let us share the grace and fellowship. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. Be with us now forevermore. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us. All the days of our life, we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Forever and ever. Amen. We're going to shout seven hallelujah. After shouting the seven hallelujah, we are going to tell seven persons remember that you are the bride of Christ. Amen. Amen. Are you ready? Seven powerful. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.